the Lock Breaking Kids, and today uh, I'm going to be showing you the padlocks that I've got in my holiday so far. So over two days, I've gone to five hardware sh shops and some other like little supermarkets, and these are the padlocks that I found. So I'm going to open the ones in their packets and in their boxes, apart from that one. I'm keeping that one in its packet. So, and then I'm going to show the other ones. So first. We've got this massive master dimple lock which is quite expensive and it's very very heavy it's got a hardened shackle then we've got like this spanish brown brand fac um it's got double locking the key looks quite like a rake if it'll focus yeah, and it's got a paracentric keyword. Got this standard padlock. It's actually a little bit hard to get the key in. There. It's just another 50mm padlock like the other one. Then we've got this small 35mm padlock. It's so small. We've got this like pattern padlock. This one's 40 millimeters, very cheap core. Now I bet you can just like stick something in there and it'll open. We've got this long shackle iron padlock. It shows two shackle catches, but only one works because it doesn't lock like that. So that's a bit of a scam. Got this brand. It's like a stainless steel shackle, ball bearings, and it's not that heavy. It's fifty millimeters. Got this tiny little A bus lock. It's so small. Um, I think this is 30 millimetres. Yeah, I think it's 30 millimetres. I've got this Tiffin padlock. Nice lock body. Another key, but it looks like a rake. Long shackle. Okay. Open this Ferrotech padlock. Scissors are a bit rubbish. Yeah. It's just it's not opening. Oh no, I ripped it. I think it needs a little bit more cut here. I can't even get it. I'll just cut it at the bottom. Why is this open? Oh, there we go. Right now, that's, that's where I already cut. I might just have to rip it. Why is it so hard? Can't even get into a padlock.
Nice. Finally. Cup. Finally got into it. That was so hard. I can't even get the keys off. Sorry, tech, padlock, hard and shackle. Um, just putting the key back on the ring. I'll probably pick it in the video. It looks pretty easy to pick. If it'll actually focus, there we go. Okay, let's go into our next one. Put this baby padlock. It's quite small. And I really don't want to destroy the packaging. This one. I have to deal with the other one. Why are these so hard to get into? All I've done is cut off the edge. Oh, no. Tiny little padlock. Gonna get the keys off. I think there's only three pins. It's so small. But then I've got a bigger version. I think I need to cut all the way right to the edge. Yeah. to get the keys off it's so frustrating you have to get the keys off it every single one and you have a key that gets in the way there we go it's just a bigger version of it of course i probably get this wrong camera I know they all look like rakes. I don't know. We've got like this missile padlock. So I'm going to cut it open. That looks so much like a rake. It's got tree double looking. I'll also probably get this one on camera. Because they all look very easy to pick. Just getting the piece of plastic out. I can't get it out. And we've got this. EHL padlock.
getting the keys off. I have to do this for every single one. Okay? They're all power sensory keyway. Apart from that. Apart from this one. That one isn't. So, same. It's just the same as all the other brass padlocks. So, that's me opening all those padlocks. So, all over here. They're all over there. So, that's all for today's video. And please like and subscribe.